There's a lot of earnest rushing about and checking things going on out there. It's the control room of a wind tunnel. I'm about to go in the wind tunnel. I've been in other wind tunnels, no big deal, but this one is it's kind of state of the art at VW in Wolfsburg. More particularly, they can replicate the weather. They can make it really, really hot, really, really windy, really, really cold, oh God. really, really wet, and also snow. It's one of the very few in the world that can do that. And uh, I'm gonna go in there. Somebody might be having a laugh at my expense here. Okay, come on, let's start with the wind. All right. Increase the speed. Okay. Oh. Good. <laughs> it can generate wind of up to 160 miles an hour. That's equivalent to a Category 5 hurricane. I can barely stand. Perfect. So let's start with the rain. And it can simulate driving rain, which is... Well, actually, it's really quite unpleasant. This is like a family holiday from the 1970s. Stop the rain simulation, please, and switch on the light. I feel like a rotisserie chicken. It can simulate scorching desert heat with temperatures of 65 degrees C thanks to its own inbuilt sun. So now start with the snow. Going in that room again. I'm a bit worried about it. Somebody left the door open yesterday. There was a hell of a draft. And then it was really hot. But today it seems to be quite chilly in there. Yeah. <clears throat> it's just fortunate I happened to turn up wearing this anyway. Oh, God. They can even drop the temperature to minus 30 and simulate an Arctic blizzard, which is probably useful if you live in the Arctic. OK, perfect. Richard, good job. Thank you. Thanks, guys. That was fun. I thought I was going to be in a car. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> It's funny, sometimes you do something and it turns out to be nowhere near as bad as you expected. And then sometimes it turns out to be a lot worse. <laughs> Thank you.